Kelsey Graham and you're at in Kelsey's Corner. Thank you everyone for joining me today. Um, we're, today we're going to learn about how to execute the perfect bun. It's November, it's cold and dreary and the last thing you want to do when you have to get up you guys, girls really, is do your hair. So that's what we're going to be learning about today. Thank you for everyone who's joining me today. We have, you want to introduce yourselves? Starting with you, Casey. Oh, well, um, I'm Casey. Hello. I'm Alon. Hello. I'm Bobby. Hello. I'm Glory. Hey. Delonte. Okay. So before we even get started, I want to ask you guys a couple questions. Is that okay? Absolutely. All right. Okay. So, Casey, um, how often do you do your hair? Uh, I do my hair every day. Every day. Awesome. So how often do you think you wear a bun? Probably once every couple of weeks. Same. Why do you wear a bun? Because, because I just need it up sometimes. It's just okay. crusty. That's cool. Um, Bob? <coughs> yes. <laughs> How are you doing today? I'm excellent. How are you? Awesome. I'm wonderful. So how often, what do you think about the bun? Uh, the bun is great. It's a great thing, you know, love the word bun. <laughs> it's wonderful. Okay. So what do you think about girls who wear buns? I love girls who wear buns. I love girls who don't wear buns. <laughs> <laughs> girls are nice. Okay. <laughs> Thank you for that. Milan, same question for you. Um, how often do you wear a bun? Never. Never? Really? Why mm -hmm. not? Um, I'm a weebologist. Got it. So a what? The, the reason <laughs> I cannot put my hair in a bun because of the way that my weave is sewn in. Okay. So never a low bun or anything like that? No. Okay. Well, we're going to actually give you some tips today on how to maneuver the weave. So thank you for saying that. Glory, how are you? Fine, thank you. I don't usually wear my hair, my hair in buns like that because I get braids most of the time. Mm -hmm. And it's hard to put it up in a bun. So that's why I don't really wear it. Okay. And Delonte? What's the question? <laughs> um, <coughs> what do you think about girls who wear buns? Uh, I mean, they're cool. That, that's really all you have to offer? Yeah. <laughs> that's I have a question for the weaveologist. Yeah, we're going to get to all <laughs> those yes, questions here. and all those inquiries in one second. So the reason buns are such a integral part of every girl and some guys hairstyles is because of the effort it takes it's literally an effortless thing all you do is put your hair up wrap it and call it a day you, there are many different types of buns you can use there are top knots there's the ballerina bun there are the side bun the low pony bun all types of buns you all would agree Absolutely. buns are very versatile they're very very versatile so today we're going to be showing you how to do a simple bun then we're going to be styling each of our casey bob and glory have agreed to um be our test dummies for the day and milan delante and i are going to be executing some buns on our dummies Okay, I have okay. reservations about that word. <laughs> <Come> <laughs> All right, so what you need to do a simple bun really are just a couple things. You need a brush, and there are several different types of brushes I have here. Um, this is a Boris brush, so it's kind of softer. And then we have the more hard brist bristled buns that you can, or brushes that you can use. And then, of course, you need some hair ties, unless you can wrap your hair around itself as it's long enough. But, you know, ties and bobby pins to secure your style. So let's get started. So I'm going to start with Casey. Oh, actually, no. We're going to start with Glory. Glory, what kind of bun are you getting today? I'm getting a side bun. Okay. So again, the simple steps to a bun are just to gather the hair and then wrap it and secure. So Delante is going to show us how easy it is. It's so easy that even a guy can do it. So today, Glory is going to be having a <coughs> slow side bun. So Delante, whenever you're ready, go ahead and get started. So what all Delonte is doing, her hair is already tied to the side, and we're just going to wrap it around the elastic, around itself, and then secure it. So while he's doing that, Glory, how do you feel about Delonte doing your hair? Uh, I'm kind of nervous. Why are you nervous? <laughs> because I've never had a guy do my hair before, and I don't know how this is going to look like. Well, he's doing a good job so far. You look um, wonderful, girl. <laughs> so, Glory. Yes. You want to look at me and tell me how you think this bun is going to come out? I think this bun is going to turn out pretty messy. <laughs> but, but messy but, buns are good Messy sometimes. buns are messy in. Buns are Absolutely. A thing. Okay, they are a thing. So. Messy buns are my thing. <laughs> okay, Delonte, how are you feeling about doing Glory's hair? All right. Yes. <laughs> 
Okay, what are you thinking right now? I'm trying to make sure I got it. It's perfect. I understand. All bun the great thing about buns is that they can be messy as you want or perfect as you want. I know there are many types of buns. Ballerinas usually have the really tight knit buns that are at the top of their head. Those are usually buns that I like to do. I actually don't have my hair in a bun today specifically for this because I was trying to be different. Usually I have my bun in a, a hair in a bun any other time, but that's not what's happening today. So Delante is almost finished. And in a minute, we will be able to see the finished product. So remember, Delante is doing a low side <coughs> bun on Glory. And we're almost done. Are you ready? <coughs> okay, let's see the finished product. That oh, looks really good. Wow, that was pretty good. What <laughs> a messy bun. Oh, right, that wasn't bad. That wasn't bad. Great job, Delante. And let's add that this is his first this time doing This is very first time doing the bun. So that was pretty good. Yes. All right, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. It's kind of a cross between a donut bun and a little messy buns. I like that. Excellent job, Delante. All right, so how do you feel? Glory? Um... Actually, I feel pretty good. That's it good. was his first time. Mm -hmm. He didn't hurt you, right? Yeah. And Delonte, you feel pretty successful? I feel guess. like you did something with your life? What? You feel like you did something with your, with your life? Yeah. Really? I mean, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thank you, guys. All right, so now we're going to move on to Milan and Bob. Bobby. Now, Milan... <clears throat> had inquiries about how to do a bun with weave. And weave is, um, for all the, those who, who don't know, weave is extensions in the hair. Um, some people get tracks, some people, I, what are tracks again? The um, tracks are when they braid them and, and they sew it into the And they sew it in, they it's called in. installation. Oh, That's the class here at work. Installation. <laughs> yes. Okay, so um, we, Milan has installation? I do, I have an she installation has the, And it's an A1 install. installation, might I add. But yeah, so with hair like Milan's, you can really, I don't see an issue with Doing a bun, but like it won't probably be a high one unless you have that type of hair where where they do like the thing where you won't right. see the track. Right. Yeah, so buns are pretty easy to do with weave or without weave, period. But you can probably scoop it into whatever, however your hair is braided. You could probably do it that way. So if your hair is braided like on this side, you could probably just swoop it and wrap the bun I around think like about that. that. Have you yeah. tried that? There are several ways to do it. So yeah, so Bob. We're going to do, what are you doing with Bob's hair, Milan? We are going to do a Princess Leia <gasps> type of bun. So it's two buns on each side. Yes, I'm not sure. Prince, if some people who do not know Princess Leia was in Star Wars. Star Wars. Carrie yes. Fisher. She's on Family Guy now. Okay. Yeah. One of those Great crazy Yep, yep, yep. <laughs> All right, Kelsey. So if you don't mind, can you pass me a brush, Why, please? certainly. Would you like a soft bristle or a hard bristle? Um, what do you prefer, Bob? Uh, we, we can do a soft. Okay, we're going to okay, do a soft brush. We're going to do the brush. soft bristle. Right here. And I'm going to start with the right hand side. And his hair is already parted, yes? Yes, his Bobby's hair is already parted. And again, it's just a couple, a few simple steps. Step one, all you have to do is gather, um, um, brush your hair. You, step one is to brush your hair. And that is what Milan is doing now. So she's getting all the hair together. And brushing the hair just helps to um, get all the hair together and make sure it's all in one complete, concise area so you can work with it better. And now she is working on... Step three. So step one, we want it to brush the hair. Step two, we gather the hair together so that it's all in one place again. And then step three, we're going to tie the hair with um, some type of tool. And the tools, again, are just um, some brushes, some hair ties, hair elastic, bobby pins if needed. And you can just see as Milan is slowly wrapping the hair around. So step one, again, I cannot enforce this enough. It's so simple, just four or five simple steps. You want to brush your hair. You want to gather the hair. Then you want to tie the hair with an elastic, wrap the hair with the elastic, and then secure it with elastic and bobby pins, as Milan is doing. Bob, how are you feeling right now? I feel uh, great and nervous at the same time. Why do you feel nervous? Because she's a wee biologist, and I'm scared my hair's going to be gone by the time I look <laughs> up and on someone else. OK, Milan, how do you, how do you feel <clears throat> I feel, Bob I feel great. as your hair model? I feel great. This is what you do, huh? This, this is, is what this is your I bread do. And butter? This is, I do this usually um, when I take my hair out. Okay. And when I deep condition it, if you can hold this one more time, thank you. I'm excited. I want to see what it looks like. Your weave is A1, though, Milan. Thank you. A1. Thank girl. you. I try. Okay. okay. So she has done the multiple steps. Well, you fast. She has brushed the hair. And we want to make hair. sure that it's tight. Yes. Brush the hair, gather the hair. Now she's wrapping the hair, and then she's going to secure it. She's going to secure the style with her hair ties and bobby pins. 
Bob, how you feeling? I'm I'm great. What do you expect to see? I am expecting to see me look like a uh, uh, someone royal. And I usually you'll be player. in a mirror in front of um you'll be in front of a mirror when you're doing this. I hope unless you're like me, you're like in the car, and you're kind of doing it kind of last minute, which is fine. Messy buns are in. They're cool. Okay. All right. So this is the finished product. His Princess Leia buns. Oh. How do you feel? Let me, let me look at it. <gasps> you want to spin him around, Milan? Oh. His Princess Leia, slowly, slowly. <laughs> yes! Perfect. Perfection. Yes! So Milan, how was, how was Bob as a hair model? He was excellent. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm so beautiful. It's going to be all right. See, that's the kind of reaction you want every time you do a Bob. <laughs> two looks now we've done the side ponytail on or that's not a ponytail the side <laughs> bun on glory and then we have the princess leia hairstyle bun on um bob and those are again testament to how simple the bun is so now we're going to do my sister patricia and we're going to do a high bun on her so all you have to do again with the steps you're going to brush your hair and patty has a lot of hair thankfully she's been brushing it lately so this isn't too hard oh. for me to do so we're just going to brush the <coughs> hair into the direction in which you want it to go. Your hair is so soft and luscious, Casey. Thanks. I'm How do you feel about, me, about your sister doing your hair? I feel like she knows what she's doing. Why do you think I know what I'm doing? Because you do your hair a lot. Okay. Are you saying that like I'm not supposed to do my hair a lot? I mean, you are, but... Okay, that makes sense. Mm -hmm. How do you think this bun's going to turn out? Well. Well? Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. So we're almost done. So I brushed the hair. Now we're going to gather it all in one place. And again, the brushing just helps you get it where you need it to be. We're going to gather it. Your baby hairs are on point. May I add, Casey? Thanks. Thanks. I tried. You're welcome. Did you dye your hair? Mm-mm. It's just brown like that. Go. Mm. Some Aren't you fancy? <coughs> I am. Okay. So now can you lift your head up for me, please? Thank you. Okay, so we're doing a top knot on Casey. So I've gathered the hair and brushed it. Now we're gonna wrap it around in a second. This is not too tight, right? Oh no. <laughs> is that sarcastic or are you serious? I'm sarcastic. Okay, we'll do that. All right, there we go. That's, that's good, right? Oh yeah. Okay, so now we're just gonna, this is what I usually do with my hair when I bun it. I put it in a ponytail, then I separate it into two, two sides and then I twist it around. This is a little top knot slash ballerina bun. So we're just gonna wrap it around. And then I do this, but the opposite side. Casey, how are you feeling? Is anyone learning anything new today? Absolutely. Yes. I love how you yes. ask me a question and it's just kind of like, You know, because you take a long time to answer. So just want to. And now I'm just going to secure the style with a hair tie. All right. Well, isn't that fancy? And this is usually what I do. This is like the white girl lazy look when they're going into Starbucks for their Frappuccino. This that is usually so what this is. Because <laughs> you, you like Frappuccinos, right? Yeah. Don't. Okay. Anyway. So how do you feel about your hair, Casey? like it. You like no, it? I can't see it. Yeah, I like oh, it. lucky for you, I have a mirror right here. Here oh, you go. I, I should have brought the bigger one out here, but I didn't do that. You see it? Oh, yeah. All right. So, there you have it. Three simple, easy, effortless styles to do. We have Glory with her side bun. We have Bob with his princess leg. We have Casey here with her top knot ballerina mix bun. And these are really super easy. So um, if you're ever in a bunch for anything, you can do this in a car, you can do this at church, in the bathroom, you can do it wherever you are. And it's not that hard. So everyone, how do you feel with your styles? Great. Uh, uh, thank you, Shaquita. You have to say, hold on. <laughs> thank you, Shaquita. Oh. All right, you guys. All right, so that's what we learned on the corner today. How to do an effortless, 
effortless bun. If um, you have any questions or concerns, you can catch Alfredo on the ground on, P on PGCCU. <laughs> no, she is Google not it. plugging her show. Yes, we are. <laughs> and that's all we have for today. So, yeah, have an awesome day, you guys. Effortless Thanks, buns. Everyone. Thank you so much. Yeah. Buns. Be happy with your buns. Bye. Bye. Bye.